At first, I wasn't excited. I wasn't. I was like, oh, it's only three. I was looking at all the negative things. Hey, y'all. It's your girl, the Kiana Nicole. So, if y'all have never heard of Cynical, it's a black-owned coffee shop. So, y'all need to check it out. It's in Austin, Georgia. Their food is amazing. Hey, y'all. So, when I tell y'all I am excited about this vacation, um, it's a mini vacation. We're going on a cruise from Friday. Then we're, we're, we're going to the Bahamas. Going to the Bahamas on a cruise from Friday until... Um, then we come back on Monday. So we're gonna drive down to Orlando. It's me, my husband, and two other couples. My friend, Cherie, and her husband, Charlie, and Shanda, and her husband. Um, so yeah, so we have done vacations before. So this is not our first vacation together. We have done, you know, some things in the past. Now, this is our first road trip together. So, I'm ex I'm excited and nervous because I'm like, okay, I'm just about to see how it's going to be with me, my husband, and two other grown, you know, couples. So, I've never done this part before. If we have done a road trip, like it, it has been me, my husband, and like my brother and his wife, but not like, you know, a group. Normally, like if we did, we did a road trip to Savannah, but everybody was in their own cars. So we're going to be renting a Suburban. I believe we go pick up the car today. And I'm going to see, but I'm excited for this vacation, three days on the cruise um i have not this this would be me and my husband second time doing the cruise i um i'm just at first i wasn't excited i wasn't i was like oh it's only three i was looking at all the negative things like oh it's only three days we only going to one stop we normally when we did the cruise last time we went to two stops now we only doing one so I started like getting upset a little bit about that. And then towards the end of the week, I'm just like, you know what? I need this. Like, oh my God, I need this. It's when I come back, it's go time. I got to prepare for this natural hair show and I'm not going to have time to fuck around or I'm just going to be fucking myself. And so like i started to like get a relief and be like you know what i'm excited i need this i'm gonna be by the water not by the water i'm gonna be on a whole lot of fucking water so if i don't get my shit together by then i don't know what it's gonna take because i already love water like to be i cannot swim but when i tell y'all i love to be around water because water is one of those things that just helps to balance me. And it's just all coming all at the right time. So I'm gonna take my journal. I have two journals. One journal that I just write, like it's all about my day. It's all about how I'm feeling. And yeah, basically that's it. And then the second journal is more on my business, like some things that I need to get done some things that I want to get done so at first I was gonna buy a whole new journal and I was like you know what I don't need to buy another journal I could just use the one now I'm starting a whole new project and that's what be going on sometimes with me just keep starting different things so I'm like no I could just use what I got and I could just you know build on to it just take my journals with me like it's not like they're they're full so I talked myself out of that. And when I went to Five Below, I didn't want to pay $5 for no damn journal anyway. And so I was like, okay, that I'm going to be buying some I don't need. But I'm super excited for this trip. It's a difference. And that's what I'm learning too. 
Like, learn to have different experience. Everything ain't gonna be the same thing when you go, if you go to, you know, and this is a new place. Like, we're going to Bahimi, Bahamas, something like that. That's a new place we never been. When we did the cruise the first time, we end up doing, um, where did we go? We went to Jamaica. We did Canaan Islands and Ocho, Ocho Rios. And then we end up going to um, Jamaica, to uh, Montego Bay for our anniversary, our 15 year anniversary. So I'm just learning, this was a check for me because I'm just learning like, learn to have different experience. You say this in your head all the time. Now you gotta practice what you preach. And so I'm, a, and I started getting more excited for the vacation. So today, before I, I knew I procrastinated and put some things off. So now I just gotta do it all. So before I did it, I was like, okay, I gotta go to the bank. Like this morning when I woke up, I was like, you know what? Okay, let me do all the things that I need to do that I need to do outside the house. And then that way I'm not in a rush and I can still get everything done inside the house. Because if I do all the things I need to get done, I'm done with outside. So that's what I did. I ended up stopping by my homegirl salon, Sabor Beauty. I was so mad because I tried to surprise her because I was just thinking about all the things I needed to do outside the house. So I was like, oh, I'm gonna go right past her shop. So I'm gonna stop, let her see my new hair. Then see my girl, Chrissy. Chrissy, who did my hair. She's not only y'all my neighbor and my friend, but she also did my hair. So I wanted to pop up on both of them. So I popped up on them. Um, Halima wasn't there. She was out. This her late day. I forgot. I just, I knew it was her late day, but then I kind of forgot that it was her late day. I just thought she would be there, but I talked to her and um, I popped up on Chrissy. Chrissy didn't know I was going to pop up on her. So I popped up on her. I said that I wasn't going to cook. Um, so then I had to go to Sephora to get my traveling bum bum cream. I love, oh, I love, my girl Chrissy put me up on this. I love my um, De La Sanero, my bum bum cream. And then I had to go to Ulta to get my lashes. Cause this trip, I'm doing a lot of stuff myself and I don't wear lashes, but these are my favorite lashes that I wear. And they work so good and I bought some glue because I like to put the glue on it so they can last longer. And then I was like, oh, I need like a clear lip gloss. So I asked the lady and she was like, the elf one is pretty good. So I'm gonna try this out too on the trip. And then I was like, okay, I'm, I told my husband, I said, look, I, I know you said you had a taste for an omelet. So I stopped and um, picked up breakfast for us. And then um, I want him to help me put this rug down get my house together so when I come back because I don't that's one of my things too my pet peeves when I come back and my house has been in like a dis disarray for a few days now because I just been so tired you know I worked at the salon and and sometimes it don't be that I'm mentally tired it's my brain is tired so I just need a mental break that's what I'm learning too so, um, but bef I can't leave my house like that before I leave. So before I leave, I got this rug that I've been waiting to put down. We're going to put the rug down. I'm going to clean it all up. Um, I got some pillows because I'm doing a little bit of like, mm, I'm, I'm just like redecorating some things. And I was like, you know what? I don't have to buy a whole new couch. I can change out the, the couch pillows. I can put down a new rug. I already took the rug out. So, you know, but I'm gonna show y'all that as well. Let me get in this house. Let me call my husband because I pulled up. He's not here. See where he's at because I need to make sure that he's about to help me with what I need him to help me with, you know, because I'm not a superwoman, and I learned that I don't have to do all the things myself. You know, I don't have to do it all myself. It's okay for me not to do it all myself. But yeah, so this is the beginning. <laughs> um, a vegetable omelet, pancakes, and 
And then it's like hash brown, wants to be grits. Oh yeah, some grits and hash brown. Before we go out of town, vacation, or anything, I like to make sure that my house is clean. Because when I come come back, I want to come back to peace. I don't want to look at anything. I don't want to see nothing out of um, disarray. I just want it to look nice and clean. Am I the only one, or do y'all do that too? And let me tell y'all, y'all is not going to be seeing a lot of cleaning videos from me. I don't know why I recorded this, but someone was in my heart just recorded, but you're not gonna get used to this <laughs> but anyway since i recorded it i'm gonna show it to y'all but um i was super excited because right before we were leaving to go out of town i had ordered some pillow covers because i wanted to change it up in my living room add like some black into it so i was like okay instead of me buying a whole new couch all new furniture let me switch out the pillows so i bought some black pillowcases i also bought like some more turquoise pillowcases as well and um i bought a rug y'all gonna see that too I finally opened up my candles from Alexis Nicole candles, my son, girlfriend. Like, do y'all do that? Y'all will buy stuff and you just got it sitting to the side and then you like, okay, I'm gonna open it up. But this was the perfect time because I was waiting to, I got my pillowcases and all of that, but I got vibes and eat me. Um, they have like vanilla scent. I love vanilla scent. And this time my husband was at home. So he was able to help me put the rug down. Y'all, I had been waiting for the perfect rug. And I was on Instagram one day and I seen this lady posted this rug. Mm -hmm. 